Paragraph 1. Warren G. Harding, the 29th President of the United States, was in office from 1921 to 1923. Harding's first priority was to restore economic productivity and prosperity as America came out of World War I. He lowered taxes and cut business regulations, while his return to normalcy policy promised a return to pre-war stability. He also signed the first legislation to protect civil rights, in the form of the Civil Rights Act of 1921. Paragraph 2. During his short-lived presidency, Harding championed foreign policy goals like global naval disarmament and participation in the League of Nations. His presidency was also an era of racial strife, fueled by the rapid urbanization that was occurring at the time. The events of the 1921 Tulsa massacre and the Red Summer of 1919 had a big impact on this president's term. Paragraph 3. Eventually, his presidency was marred by corruption scandals and his administration became increasingly beset by controversy. Ultimately, he died in office in 1923, with his vice president Calvin Coolidge succeeding him. Harding can be viewed as a president who had good ideas, but circumstances involving his administration's dealings hindered them. Thanks for watching anything in one minute.